an engine takes in 5 moles of air so 5 moles of air at a temperature is equal to 20 degrees celsius which can be written as 293 kelvin and pressure is equal to 1 atm and compresses it adiabatically to the 1 by 10th of the original volume let's say original initial volume is v then final volume is v by 10 Assuming air to be diatomic ideal gas made up of rigid molecules, so as it is a diatomic gas, so degree of freedom is 5. The change in its internal energy during the process is delta U is equal to. Now, what is the formula for delta U? We know that delta U is equal to NCV delta T, right? So, and what is CV? F by 2 R final temperature minus initial temperature. Now we have N F R. Uh, we have temperature also initial temperature. Now first find the final temperature. Now it is given that the process is adiabatic process. For adiabatic process, we have direct relation of temperature and volume. Temperature into volume to the power gamma minus 1 is equal to constant, right? So, this will be equal to T1 into V1 to the power gamma minus 1 is equal to T2 into V2 power gamma minus 1. T1 is equal to 293. V1 is V to the power gamma minus. Gamma is, achha, what is the value of gamma here? Gamma can be written as F plus 2 divided by F. So, this is equal to 5 plus 2 divided by 5. So, this will be 7 by 5. This is the value of gamma so 7 by 5 minus 1 7 by 5 minus 1 will be 2 by 5 so this is 2 by 5 is equal to t2 into v by 10 ka power 2 by 5 now this v v ka gets cancel out t2 can be written as 290 into 10 to the power 2 by 5 so this is equal to 293 into 10 to the power 2 is 100 so 100 ka power 1 by 5 so this can be t2 can be written as <coughs> 293 into 100 ka power if you solve for this 100 ka power 1 by 5 and if you multiply this with 293 you will get it as 736 kelvin 736 kelvin so put the data here n is 5 f is 5 5 by 2 r into delta t delta t final temperature is 736 initial temperature is 293 so this will be equal to 25 by 2 r into 443 right now put the value of r uh, option is c assuming the air to be diatomic rigid molecule the change in its internal energy during this process comes out to be x kilojoule the value of x to the nearest integer is now uh, this 25 by 2 into 443 into r put the value of r you will get finally it has 46 kilojoule so your answer is 46